there's something out there, man. Yo, the, like the bite is very strong. <laughs> you know, I pull, I didn't hook, bait's gone. I just hope it's not big as a spot tail pinfish or something like that. It could be, man. I saw some diving yesterday that were like a foot long, dude. Not yeah, like, man. Spot tail, they were the regular pinfish. It was like they were leading, they were the head of the spot tail. Uh huh. Oh, dude, I'm telling you, what is that? Houndfish? I think that's a houndfish. Wait, what is that? Bro, bro, bro. Yeah, I think it's a ladyfish, bro. Yo, bro, this is a new species for me, bro. Oh, <laughs> yes, son. Dude, that's what I'm talking about, man. Yo, when I saw you see how I rushed from those rocks? Because if it falls in there, it doesn't count, you know? Yo, my first ever ladyfish. So maybe it was ladyfish yeah, that it was good. biting. I don't know. About to get, uh, hook out wow, man, my first ever ladyfish. Species number 210 for me. Woo, this is what I'm talking about, boy. All right, folks. So this right here is my first ever ladyfish. It's all messed up now, but that is okay because I'm saving this fish as cut bait. They actually say that this fish is really good cut bait. So, you know, I'm going to use it later at nighttime for some surf fishing. But this is species number 200 and tan for me. I see. Oh, that's nicer. Maybe another ladyfish. What is this? Oh, see, you see there's something following it? No, what is that? Oh, dude, is that a ballyhoo? Is that a ballyhoo? Oh, 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 let me let me come up here, man. I don't know what this is. Yo, bro, this is my second ever ballyhoo. Yeah, 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 this is a ballyhoo. This is amazing bait, bro. Yeah, dude, this is a ballyhoo. No! Well, the ballyhoo fell. I'll take a shot. There's another species for this trip. And the blue runner was just fall, fall hooked. We're not, we're not going to count this blue runner. Bye-bye. We're going to take shots of the ballyhoo, though. Woo! This is, this is juicy. My second ever ballyhoo. Yeah! Folks, final view of our beautiful ballyhoo right here, little red tip, okay? This is my second one ever. This is pretty crazy. This is a beautiful fish. Amazing bait too. Yo! What's up, YouTube? Leo Shang here, host of the Extreme Full Fishing Channel. Just had myself a hearty meal and plenty of fluids. I'm filled to the top. Back here at the Boca Raton Inlet. Gotta do some more fishing. It is still the afternoon, right? I gotta fish until sunset. Tide is currently going from low to high. I am really hoping that that is going to bring a few more species to the table today. I'm going to get it started, maybe at the wall, but I'm going to shift spots here and there. Man, this Florida slam is going extremely well. Let me tell you, I am blessed, folks. I am blessed, you know, to have been able to, caught, uh, to catch so many species down here. Currently at 2.10 and working more and more right so stay tuned hopefully something good is going to show up come on there's one what we got oh yeah that's another species i don't i don't have yet for this trip it's a big pork fish Anitros, Anisotremus virginicus. Check that out. Ah, beautiful pork fish. Yellow with two black bars right here. Yeah, that's more of what I'm talking about. 
There we go, folks. Yet another species for our Florida. The species is lamb, a beautiful pork fish, the Anisotremus virginicus. It is a type of grunt. I don't know why they call it the pork fish, though, but I tell you what, it's a beautiful fish, all right? Let's put it back over here. Boom! And there it goes. Get it, boy! I'm not a pork fish, okay? Ah, these are some real nice pork fish, though. Gotta give it credit, they pull hard. Look at that, huh? They say it is good eating. Well, this Asian ain't gonna find out about pork fish today, though. Boom. There, there's one. Uh huh. Sailor's grunt, huh? Sailor's choice grunt. Nice eating size too. Man, they're getting big this time of the year. I see. Oh man, I may need the pliers for this guy. Oh no, we good, we good. Never know, man. Maybe, maybe this is gonna be the ticket to my cornet fish. <laughs> I don't know about that, but. When the dude caught it, he had no idea what it was either. He's like, oh my God, right what is, yeah, dude, what, right over there. I was like, damn, I was like, unbelievable. I come here like every year, you know, never saw one. Dude has no idea what it is, pulled one. Oh, squid or cut bait. a big ass grunt I, I gotta give it man the grunt are pretty big in this holes man <laughs> yo this is good eating size right here bro this this, this yo i'm telling my latino friends brother they take this no problem you know ay 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 okay my friend it is your lucky day okay your lucky day you're not going to get eaten Live a fruitful life, carpe diem. Let me see. It's the same one as before. Man, I think just dusky. I'm not 100% though. Come here. Oh, 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 easy. Easy. What? I have this already. Oh, it's a hi hat. This is rare, dude. This yeah. is, this is rare. This is, I, I can tell you, this is, this is rare, man. See, dude, when you poke inside the holes, man. Damn. Yeah, I, th I think this is a hi-hat. Yeah, that's what it looks like. Yeah. Man. Oh, bro, I gotta take a shot, but this is rare, bro. Oh, man. This is like, cost money, man. This cost a lot of money. All right, folks, I think this fish suffered enough abuse already. This is what we call a hi-hat. Although, I don't know if there's only one species of hi-hat or not out there. So here's a nice view on the dorsal fin, okay? I'm gonna release this guy. This is a real, real nice catch. It's not, it's not too easy to come by by one of these fish, you know? Nice. The, oh, careful, careful, careful. Very careful. Scorpion fish? Yeah, there's a spotted scorpion fish. You don't want to touch it, man. You touch one of these, you die, man. No, okay, you don't die. But you go to the hospital. Yeah, there is definitely a scorpion fish, man. Gotta handle these with a lot of care, you know? All right, folks, final view 
of our very exotic spotted scorpion fish right here this fish actually got venom on the top fin and bottom fin so you're gonna be very careful when handling it you definitely don't want to get spined by this fish you're gonna end up in the hospital you know so I'm just gonna release this guy over here I've caught this species before they are very sturdy fish but yeah that's a nice addition to our Florida species lamb Got a hit. Ah, it's fish on. Wait, the, is it really on or did I miss it? Oh, it's on, it's on. What we got here? Little lane snapper. We got one of these today already. Very beautiful fish, for sure. But, you know, this is not a new number, not a new addition to our species list for this trip. So let me just quickly unhook this guy here. Oh man, right on the bony side of the mouth. All right, there it goes, slain snapper. There is about one and a half hour to sunset, folks. Tide is very, very low. I think the Centron took enough of a beating today already. So I have just switched to the super power braided line and the Valiant Eagle Rail. I gotta try this spot at the jetty one more time in hopes that some new species are going to show up. Wish me luck. Dang, son. It's definitely biting out there, but it's all the same thing. Nothing new. It's all Moharas, man. There's Moharas that I can't even identify. I'm taking all of them to be spot fin Mohara because, you know, Moharas are just so hard to identify there's a bunch of them out there there's like a whole school nothing new check that out I mean it's a beautiful fish but yeah I don't know about that we got enough of these oh boy it is about sunset right now folks overall it's been a very productive day here at the inlet huh I mean today is day three down here in florida i would say that overall this has been a very productive trip so far 35 species of fish in three days that is pretty good in my books you know <laughs> anyways it is time for me to go back to the hotel uh i would like to give a big shout out uh to the person who showed up in the video today he is a fellow multi-species angler who lives down here in Florida, you know. I had a blast fishing with him, although I didn't get a lot of footage, you know, of me interacting with him. So, shout out to you, my man. Next time I come down to Florida, we will definitely fish around your area, okay? Alright, folks, I am super tired. I'm not going to say too much in this outro. Got to go back to the hotel, get something to eat, replenish my HP bar, okay? And who knows, maybe for the rest of the day, I'm going to do some nighttime surf fishing, or maybe I just gotta take it easy tonight, because tomorrow I'm going freshwater fishing again, try to add a few more species, you know, to those 35. I don't know how, I don't know how many species you voted in that poll in the first video of the series, but let me tell you, I hope you just had a little bit of faith on EPF, okay? All right, folks, I'll see you guys. I'll see you all next time. Tight lines and take it easy. Oh, oh. It's on. It's on, it's on, it's on, it's on, it's on. I don't know what it is, but it's on. Not bad. Not bad at all. Bro, what the heck did we get here? Is that a Mohara? What is it? It's all dark. Can't see it. Dang, son. It is a mangrove snapper from the surf. How exactly this happens? I have no clue. Came snagged in two locations too. 
Did I even hook this dude by the mouth? Bro, what is a mangrove snapper doing out there in the surf at night time? Not bad, man. Whatever these things are, they bite good. Is that a mangrove? Yeah, I think it's another snapper. Dang, dude. What we got here? Holy macaron. It's a big ass grunt. Holy moly, son, this is eating, eating size grunt right here. Wow, it's a sailor's choice grunt. You know what? I wasn't really planning on eating any fish from down here in Florida, but the hotel that I'm staying at does have a kitchen. And bro, this is a very decent sized grunt right here. It is legal to take. Why would I waste it, right? Let's take it back to the hotel and eat it. Oh my goodness, all the way out there. Crap, I'm out of range. You guys, you guys see that? You guys see that? Oh, I'm out of range. I'm just a tiny bit out of range. They have to come back in. Whew, that was some crazy...